Daily Update, 7-19-12. Bringing humanity home, energy and event update. We are in exciting moments on planet Earth, equal heart. Greetings, love beings. There are a few words to describe how excited, evil excited, we are about these moments we are in on planet Earth, equal heart. The reason we are excited as it was four years ago in which we planted the seeds of love everywhere present into the collective consciousness for our divine events to manifest here on planet Earth Equal Heart into physicality. We have spent every moment, 24-7, since these were planted, to be in service to this love which is manifesting within you and who humanity truly is. All of your higher selves are also participating, also participating, in laying the foundational energies required for these moments. We are now going to see these seeds of love blossom right before humanity's eyes. The Kundalini energy is arriving and there's absolutely no stopping this energy. The energies will be increasing as each moment increases at light speed vibration. The more one on this planet resists the changes occurring, the more challenging it will become. spirit dancer. Beloved family of light, as you move to this next phase of connection and restart connection, you will also connect to the intense energy of awakening the dragons and the dolphin masters. These two groups of beings of light are focused on this part of the 2012 alignments and are ready to cooperate with those of you who are ready for them. The first of you will in the fifth dimension encounter the dragon energy. The dragons are the carriers of the higher dimensional cosmic fire, or angel fire. This is a very basic but powerful energy, your nuclear energy, call it if you consider it in scientific terms. The basic fire, the holographic matrix in place. We are your leaders in the kingdom of heaven, your elders, us. We have taken our places and roles within the divine plan unfolding and manifesting. This includes all the angels, all the Galactic Federations, and all universes are also in place for the grand celebration. In all cities around the planet, we have ships hovering and on standby. The human eyes may not see them yet, but they are there. We have many light beings, aka human angels, who have now accepted their roles and are in position around the planet. This is to assist and assure humanity's release from the chains of illusion within all government structures, corporate structures, and all who support anything except for what is the highest good for everyone on this planet. This planet has been secured by love. We, your Earth allies, are standing in the kingdom of heaven waiting for everyone. We just happen to arrive here first. This was to say, welcome home, God. We are now preparing for the 8812 energies, which will spiral all of us upward. Soon after this, the Earth allies are to be announced as a part of a team of elders, as examples and mirrors of pure love for everyone on this planet. Quoted from Sheldon Nidal, We are here. We come with good news for all. The process of returning you to your sovereignty is starting to reach the point of fruition. We are employing a technology that is resulting in the collapse of the Dark Ones and their empire, and we fully expect to be able to remove them from their positions of dwindling power. As you can see, much is being done to prepare your for immense change, leading to the grand event of your return to full consciousness. Along the way, there will be disclosures and numerous announcements, which will boldly alter this planet as you now know. We too look forward to taking up our divine service in a more open manner as we have a great deal of sacred information to impart to you. Our service to you will begin with a wide range of teachings that get to bring you full consciousness and which will include a series of healings that will demonstrate the immense power the Creator has endowed you with. Full consciousness comes with sacred responsibilities which you will come to understand and cherish. Each of you possesses an endless 
almost boundless potential that is now about to become manifest within you. These words mark the start of a series of events soon to be upon you. We welcome all that the Creator has decreed for us. The time comes for our presence to be announced and for astonishing events to manifest as they lead swiftly to your return to full consciousness. End of quote. Many events are already occurring on many levels. As we speed forward, we will now begin to see structures that no longer support heaven come tumbling down. This includes everything that no longer supports life or supports the greater good of the whole, and this is by divine decree. By Quincy and Salusa. For some time now, we have been limiting the extent to which the dark ones can interfere with your progress towards ascension. We wish to assure you that the time has come for you to take action. We know that you can succeed and we will be overseeing what takes place. All of the light forces are lined up against the dark ones and will ensure that you are able to complete your objectives to remove those who stand in your way. These measures will be the commencement of a whole string of moves to repel you into the new age. What is happening is part of your battle against those who have plotted your demise and it is important that you are seen to overcome them. Whatever course you adopt, you will succeed. But we want you to abide by the rules that have been laid down. You do not need to meet fire with fire, as you have the law on your side, along with us and many great beings of light. With so much light reaching you, we find consciousness levels are rising, and many souls are being awakened as a result. This is wonderful news as it means the forces of light are growing all the time and dissipating the lower energies that the dark ones feed upon. You must have noticed that when you meet light workers, they carry an air of calmness that is very uplifting. That, dear ones, is where you will all eventually find yourselves and you will know that you have at last now you have been seeking. Each day brings you a bit closer to the government announcements that shall trigger the commencement of the benefits that are to go to you. There will be no stealing with such schemes, and only our appointed and trusted allies shall be given the responsibility to look after them. It all has to commence very soon, and will continue well after ascension. What we are lining up to do is to get things moving, but not before those who are against our actions are safely out of the way. It is clearly worth waiting those extra few days and see matters working out as planned. I'm Salusa from Sirius and fortunate to have a view of what's going on that far exceeds your authority's own vision. The Galactic Federation of Light has technologies that can track anyone's activities and record their speech if necessary. So be assured you are safe and protected by us. End of quote. The Grace Light, which arrived in July of 2008 is being released once again, allowing creation a clear space to create. And Creator always creates more grandness. What this means is the Creator is now releasing gifts. All lives are on planet Earth equal heart. We are in the final countdown moments before the greatest events in humanity's history will occur. This is all also where all prophecies manifest. Decreed by heaven. Unity consciousness is now to be fully established on planet Earth equal heart. This is the divine plan manifesting now on planet Earth equal heart. Thank you for spreading these messages to others and keeping your hearts open and staying tuned in. Just be present and follow the synchronistic events. End transmission and all love is unconditionally. We are so in love with humanity. Love the glad to be staff, humanity's Earth allies, the company of heaven and the first contact round two.